In this tutorial, I'm going to be covering suitability modeling, or more specifically, diagramming. Suitability diagramming. The first step of the process involves diagramming our suitability model. This is a way to think through the analysis process before actually performing the analysis. Suitability modeling is oftentimes used to help us visually map site assets, possibilities, vulnerabilities, threats, and constraints. Suitability diagramming can be done on paper or software capable of diagramming. There are several software packages available capable of creating such diagrams. Below are three I like to use. Microsoft Excel, SmartDraw, and Illustrator. Each have their strengths and weaknesses. Microsoft Excel is best used for sharing with others in, within your firm or company. The diagrams are small and shareable through email. Everyone also usually has Microsoft Office installed and they can also edit your diagrams. However, the diagrams that are produced from Microsoft Excel are not often very visually aesthetically pleasing and the amount of creativity that you can put into your diagrams is somewhat limited in Microsoft Excel. A second program that I like to use is called SmartDraw. SmartDraw has pre-made diagrams as part of its software packages, so this can save you a lot of time because you can just choose a template. And many of the diagrams that you create within SmartDraw can be converted into Gantt diagrams, which are timeline charts. One of the drawbacks of using SmartDraw is not everyone has SmartDraw, and in order to share it, you'll have to print out an output, which means that nobody can really edit your diagrams. The third diagramming software is Illustrator. Illustrator's strength is that it is very visually, it creates very visually pleasing diagrams. Illustrator allows you to be very, very creative with your diagrams, but one of the drawbacks of Illustrator is that you have to create everything from scratch. There aren't any templates, so this can take you some time. And some offices, some firms out there may have the Adobe Creative Suite so they can edit your diagrams.